guys, what's going on? My name is Lewis, and God bless every single one of you. Today is August 4, 2024, and welcome to the Real GS News Channel. All right, guys, so we have some urgent information coming out. If you can, please share this video, and we have a big breaking news red alert. The Sleeping Giant Military is not ready for a major biblical war. Official report shakes DC. Now the National Guard Association of the US is also sounding the alarm here. Alright, so we're gonna see what's going on guys. Once again, we are getting involved in many, many biblical wars. The UKR, the Bear, South K Taiwan, the Holy Land. I mean we're getting involved in all these biblical wars. The National Guard are sounding the alarm. Alright guys, before I start, give this video a big thumbs up, share this video with your friends, family, and loved ones. I appreciate the love and support. And for those of you that want to contribute to the channel, once again, the PayPal link and the Patreon link is in the description box. Also guys, $1 a month Patreon, we get you access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about on the platform. Also, I posted videos today, those links will be in the comments box. And for those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests, you can send it to me, Luis Santiago, or my wife, Jessica Santiago, at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. All right, let's see what's going on here, guys. Once again, please share this video. The lights are going on and off. Uh, i got to make this video really quick here, guys. Uh, we live in the state of Florida, so we're getting that storm. Uh, Debbie, it's a category one, so please pray for us. The sleeping giant is unprepared. The sleeping giant is unprepared for a potential biblical war with major adversaries because its military lacks both the capabilities and the capability needed to fight. A congressional report says, according to the 114 page document released on Monday, the Sleeping Giant National Defense Strategy, written before the start of the Biblical War in UKR in 2022, is outdated. So we basically have decreased ever since we stuck our nose in the yellow and blue country military operation. Again, the war that's going on between UKR and Russia. So there are consequences when it comes to sending a lot of stuff. Now, the Sleeping Giants, well, the Sleeping Giants are weak. A again, we basically have nothing. We gave everything away. The Sleeping Giant military is not properly structured. And the country's industrial base in Holy, uh, excuse me, Wally, inadequate to deal with potential warning. As typically reported by the National Guard Association of the U.S., Sleeping Giant is closer to raging war, a major biblical war, with a near rival than any time in the last 80 years. And a nation, including the Sleeping Giant military, is unprepared. But according to the VP, Mrs. Harris, the 4-6 is the greatest leader in Sleeping Giant history. He's the best. He's the greatest. I don't know what, but again, of course they're gonna say that. They need to say nice things because he stepped down. <laughs> so, but uh, and that's another reason why he stepped down because he's not the greatest. Put it like that. But the four six has put this sleeping giant into a deep uh, problem, big problems. That's the conclusion of a report released Monday by the Committee on National Defense Strategy, a bipartisan panel charged by the House to review the NDS. Now, the committee's 114-page report said the NDS is outdated. The Sleeping Giant military is poorly structured, and the na nation's industrial base is grossly inadequate to counter the warning from the bear and the Red Dragon. The nation was last prepared for such a struggle during the cold WAR, which ended 35 years ago, the report said. It's not ready today. 
Worse than report, excuse me, worse, the report said that the sleeping giant public is unaware. Well, again, not true. There is at least a small percentage of the sleeping giants that know that this thing is going on. Preppers know it. Um, Watchmen, Watchwoman knows it. But a great number of sleeping giants are unaware of this event. They think that everything is fine. Everything's great. We live in this paradise world that we don't get uh, impacted. Once again, the report said that the sleeping giant public is unaware of the warning posed by a nation entering a major biblical war. The sleeping giant public is largely unaware of the risk facing the sleeping giant or the cost, financial and otherwise, required to prepare and adequately the report notes. A bipartisan call to arms is urgently needed so that the sleeping giant can make the big changes and major investment now instead of waiting for the next Pearl Blank or 2001. He continued, the support and determination of the sleeping giant public is essential. The National Guard Association of the Sleeping Giant was founded in 1878 as a congressional lobbying organization on National Guard issues. A member of the military coalition, NGAUS, lobbies on behalf of the more than 400,000 officer and enlisted members who make up the organization membership. All right, so once again, guys, some very important information here. The Sleeping Giant military is not ready for a major biblical war. We are not ready. The National Guard Association of the Sleeping Giant is also sounding the alarm. We are not ready. Let's see what's going on with this one here, guys. We have uh, breaking news updates. All right, so I did talk about the bunkers and also we did talk about the emergency notification uh, broadcast, but this is an update here. I'm not going to read the whole thing. I'm just going to skip certain parts here and see what the updates are. So five front biblical war. Hmm. The Holy Land opens underground nuclear shelter. We did talk about that. Shock finds shakes relations with Egypt. The Holy Land said Persia strike will last days and break red lines. All right, let's see what's going on here, guys. We're going to see what's going on with these updates. <clears throat> For the first time in decades, the Shin Bet has opened. The pit. The pit has opened the underground nuclear bunker in Jerusalem, known as the Doomsday Bunker, which will house the country top people military and officials and govs and security complex a sign that holy land is preparing for biblical large war mm, doomsday bunker the doomsday bunker has completed preparation for the operation of the underground command and control shelter in Jerusalem, intended to house the most important people meanwhile regular citizens that's what Ben is saying. The shelter is equipped with all means of uh, McDonald's, excuse me, all means of command and control. It is connected to the pit, the headquarters of the Ministry of Defense and Tel Aviv and all other shelters. Senior leaders can stay for a long time during a biblical war, and it is in vulnerable reports the Holy Land News website said this move was deemed necessary in Holy Land as according to I'm gonna skip that name now Persia believes that the takeout of the the person cross Persia red line therefore Persia will respond in a way that crosses the Holy Land red lines mm. Look at this. Anger in Holy Land over Egypt. 
Secret H A M A S Equipment Tunnel Found. Once again, you have the senior Holy Land Defense and Secretary official are expressing their anger at Egypt after the discovery of the equipment tunnels. Uh oh. Egypt. A huge tunnel that runs deep from the town of. Oh, look at that! Very important city in the strip there. Um, goes under the Egyptian border wall and into the Sunim Peninsula of Eastern Egypt. Was recently discovered by the Holy Land forces. Wow. Um, so there's a possibility the bad guys are gone. <laughs> Man, the tunnel is more than three meters high. Large enough for trucks carrying equipment. Oh my goodness. Wow. The Holy Land accused Egypt of allowing the creation as of a secret arms transport. Egypt has allowed Holy Land security to be damaged for years. The Holy Land confident in Egyptian mediation and the negotiation for the return of the abductees is almost zero. Wow. Ooh. Look at this. Yeah, you can fit like a Humvee in there. Wow. Wow. Persia strike will last for days. All right, so there's some very important updates here. Several meetings of officials took place in the Holy Land to prepare the land for a Persia strike that could lead to five front biblical war. Persia and his proxy seek to surround us with a suffocating strike, said the Holy Land PM Benjamin Warren that anyone who harms our land will be held accountable. He will pay a very, very heavy price. Once again, Ben is putting out his message. Their visible aggression and insatiable. The Holy Land is not helpless. We are determined to stand against them on every front and every arena, far and near. Now, once again, senior Holy Land officials are preparing for a multi-day defensive by Persia. Hellsbull and other Persia back groups and respond to the takeout of this very important person. Officials believe that the strike will include hundreds of flying objects, rockets, and drones attempting to overwhelm the Holy Land air defenses, the Iron Dome, over a period of at least three days. The sleeping giant in the Holy Land officials said both Persia and Hellsbull are still working to final, uh, uh, finalize their military plans and get them approved. Now, a Persian source told the news that the retaliation will be severe and painful. Persia can uh, impact Holy Land citizens or senior officials abroad in addition to launching some very powerful equipment at home. The WSJ notes that Persia has told the news diplomats it doesn't care if the response sparks a biblical war with Holy Land according to people familiar with the talks. Finally, the Holy Land military announced the creation of a new large-scale emergency warning system, uh, similar to the Sleeping Giant Emergency Alert System. This system will allow location-based emergency uh, messages to be distributed to residents in second using mobile phones antenna. And I did post a video, the link will be in the comments box. I'm way ahead of all these news here, guys. So that's what's going on. We're about to see some huge biblical war in the mid E. National Guards are saying we are not ready for this biblical war. Sleeping giant military is not ready for a major biblical war. But don't worry. Because the LEFT said we have the best sleeping giant leader in sleeping giant history and his name is Joe and he said he's gonna take us out of all this he said that he's gonna take us out of, uh, take us out of all this so we're gonna wait and see but I warned that he ain't gonna take us out of WWE 3 he's gonna take us into WWE 3 November could possibly be canceled 
Thank you so much for watching, guys. Please share the video. For those of you that want to give a like to Christ, you can email me. My email is in the description box. Me and my wife are here to help many and to lead many to the righteous path. And that's the path of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. For those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests, you can send it to me, Louis Santiago, or my wife, Jessica Santiago, at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. Once again, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get you access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about in the platform. Also, I posted videos today. Those links will be in the comments box. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you all. Put faith and trust in Jesus Christ. For he's the only way, the truth, and the life. No one gets to the Father but through Jesus. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time later. Peace.